North America, Climate, Vegetation and Wildlife, Part 2. The climatic region of the prairies or the temperate grasslands is found in the interior of lowlands in the heart of the continent. Southern central Canada and most of central USA comes under the influence of this type of climate. This region has extremes of temperatures since it is far away from the moderating influence of the sea. Such a climate is known as the continental type of climate. Winters are very cold with plenty of snow while the summers are quite hot. Rainfall is moderate and mostly occurs in the summer season. It decreases from east to west. Coyotes, gophers, rabbits, prairie falcon and prairie dogs are the major animals that are found here. Bison or American buffalo is the most important animal for the Native Americans and once dominated this region. It became almost extinct due to indiscrimination but is a protected animal now. The Laurentian or the cool temperate East Margin type of climate is similar to that of the prairie except that it is milder due to the influence of the sea. This type of climate occurs in the northeastern part of North America. Winters are cold in this region. The cold Labrador current makes this region cold in winter. The summers are warm with moderate rain throughout the year. But most of it occurs in summer. The westerlies blow from the land and are quite dry but they pick up moisture as they blow over the Great Lakes and bring rainfall to this region. The vegetation of this region is mainly mixed forest where both coniferous trees and deciduous trees grow together. In the warmer regions, trees like the oak, maple and the chestnut are common. Forbearing animals like bears, foxes, Deer, beavers, skunks and squirrels are found in the forest. The British or the cool temperate west margin type is also known as the oceanic type, the maritime type or the west European type. This type of climate occurs on the western coastal areas of Canada and northern California in USA. It has warm summers and mild winters. The warm Alaska current makes this region warmer than it otherwise would have been. Heavy rainfall is well distributed throughout the year. The Rockies prevent the influence of the westerlies from going further inland. The main vegetation of this region comprises of the tall coniferous trees mainly the fir. Some of the important trees found here are the Douglas fir, redwood, sequoias and spruce. Fur-bearing animals such as hares, badgers, squirrels, hedgehogs, beavers and bears are found here. The Mediterranean type of climate is found in Southern California along the west coastal margin south of the British type of climate. The summers in this region are hot and dry while the winters are mild and wet. This is due to the seasonal shifting of the wind belts. In summer they are influenced by the offshore trade winds and in winter they are influenced by the onshore westerlies. The vegetation of this region is adapted in different ways to withstand the hot and dry summers. Trees like the cock oak have thick spongy barks that prevent excessive loss of moisture. Grape vines develop very long roots in search of water. Plants such as lemon, orange and laurel 
develop small leathery leaves to reduce loss of water through transpiration. The olive tree has waxy leaves for the same reason. Tall trees are rare in this region. But California has some of the rarest, biggest, oldest and the tallest trees in the world. The giant sequoias of southern Sierra Nevada can reach a girth of 24 meters. The oldest trees, the bristlecone pines, high in the mountains were seedlings when the Egyptian pyramids were built 4,600 years ago. Oak, walnut, almond, fig, as well as the cedars, pines and firs are found here. Not much wildlife is found here since most of the natural vegetation has been removed to make land available for agriculture. The hot desert type of climate is found in southwest USA and the adjoining Mexican desert. Winters are cool and summers are hot with very little rain. The hot and dry conditions in this region allow very little vegetation to grow. The plants that grow here obtain and conserve water in various ways. The cactus is the most common vegetation that is found here. It has short roots near the ground surface so that it quickly absorbs the morning dew before it evaporates. It stores water in its fleshy stem. In the cactus plant, the leaves are modified into spines. By thus reducing the leaf surface, water is conserved. The spines also protect the plants from animals. Moisture is conserved in the stems, which then become thick and succulent. The Sonoran Desert in Arizona, USA is well known for its fleshy and thorny plants such as giant cigarro, choya, and other varieties of cacti and yucca. Animals that can survive with very little water live here. The desert fox, gazelles, scorpions, lizards, rattlesnakes, and various kinds of insects are found here. In desert, the rate of evaporation exceeds rainfall. They get less than 25 centimeters of rain per year. Deserts also experience huge temperature fluctuations. The low humidity during the day allows more than 90% of the sun's heat to reach the ground. As such, day temperatures can be as high as 49 degrees Celsius. At sunset, heat is rapidly lost to the atmosphere due to the absence of insulating clouds. The nighttime temperatures can drop to minus 5 degrees Celsius. The deserts of North America like Mojave, Great Basin and the Sonoran deserts are dry because they are great distance inland or because they are on the leeward side of a mountain range. The clouds along with the humidity that comes off the ocean rarely reach them. Desert birds and animals include the roadrunner, elf owl, spiders, snakes and scorpions. Birds like the cactus wren nest in the leaves of the Joshua tree. While rodents like the pack rat build their home at the base of the tree. Insects like the yucca moth, weevil and termites also depend on the tree and in return help in pollination. China type or the warm temperate east margin type of climate is found in Florida and the Gulf Coast states in southeast USA. It lies in the trade wind belt which are onshore winds that blow throughout the year. Rainfall decreases from the east to the west, becoming dry by the time it reaches the desert. A unique feature of this region is the hurricane, whose tracks sweep over the West Indies 
and bring plenty of rain. Hurricanes can be very destructive. Summers are hot and winters are mild with moderate rainfall almost throughout the year. Mixed forests are found here. Chestnut, oak and poplar are found in the warmer regions while coniferous trees dominate in the cooler regions. Swamp forests of cypress trees are found along the coast in Florida. Foxes, squirrels, deer, raccoons, rabbits, muskrats, water moccasins, manatees, garpikes, white ibises and alligators are found here. The tropical climate is found in southern Mexico, Central America and the West Indies. It is very similar to the monsoon type of climate. It is hot and humid with abundant rainfall brought by the northeastern trade wind throughout the year. The natural vegetation comprises of trees like palm, logwood, mahogany and similar hardwood trees. Rubber and cacao are native to this region. The wildlife in these forests consists of birds and animals like monkeys, parrots, hummingbirds and snakes. In the Rocky Mountains, climatic conditions change with altitude which results in broad zones, each with its typical plants and animals. Temperature decreases while ascending the mountain slopes. The capacity of air to hold water vapor decreases, causing an increase in rain and snow. The thin, dry air loses heat very quickly and so nights in the mountains are very cold. The height above which it is too cold and windy for trees to grow is called the tree line. Beyond the tree line, there are only low grade perennial bushes and shrubs. This type of vegetation is known as the alpine vegetation. The height above, which there is permanent cover of ice and snow, is known as the snow line. Above the snow line, no vegetation can grow. The animals common to this region are deer, bears and wingless insects. 